Number five, show that the speed of sound in 20 degrees Celsius air is 343 meters per second, as claimed in the text. All right, so basically what's important to know is that sound, the speed of sound is affected by the temperature of the air in which the sound is traveling through. All right, now we have a formula that relates then the speed of sound to the temperature, and it's over here on the right hand side. I'll put it in a box. All right, let me write it out. That the velocity of the uh, sound wave, okay, is going to be equal to 331 meters per second multiplied then by the square root of the temperature, the measured temperature, all right, divided then by, or the temperature of the air, divided by 273. That's just a constant, all right? So essentially, if you notice, there's only two variables in this formula, the speed of a sound wave, V, and temperature, the measured temperature, okay? So as you can see, it's a direct relationship, basically, right? Not proportional because there, this is under the square root, but as temperature goes up, we notice that the velocity will also go up, right? If the temperature goes down, proportionally, the, uh, although not equally, the velocity will go down, okay? So all I now need to do is basically, and oh, by the way, by the way, huge thing, right? You know that almost all problems, except for the ones that we were dealing with in terms of heat, um, you know, calorimetry and whatnot, the temperature must be in Kelvin, okay? So please, 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 please keep that in mind here. So Kelvin, all right. So now the velocity of the sound wave will be equal to 331 multiplied by the square root of the measured temperature. Now, what did they tell us the temperature of the air is? Well, it's 20 degrees Celsius, but we can't have it in Celsius, right? We have to have it in Kelvin. So simply take 20 and add 273 to it. All right, that would be the Kelvin temperature then. Plug that in in the numerator and divide that now by 273. Right, mathematically, please do not cancel those. They do not cancel in that fashion. All right, so please now just plug in to the calculator. So it's going to be 331, 331 multiplied by square root parenthesis, open parenthesis, 20 plus 273. You could also do that in your head if you like, close the parenthesis and then divide it by 273. And what do we get? We get 342.9 or aka rounded 343 meters per second. All right, guys. So thanks very much for tuning in. Appreciate it very much. If you'd like to help us out, subscribe. That's the best way. And also to tell your friends, even better. Thank you so much.